Hey guys, it is Anush Patel from AndroidRoots.com. Let's go ahead and take a look at Dota Launcher for the Android device. And this launch is all about themes and customization. Um, so if you want to launch with a lot of that and, and easy to do it also, you know, you can just install one package and it's all completely redesigned. Go ahead and take a look at Dota Launcher. So we're going to go ahead and directly just dive into themes and customizations. Um, so right here, as you can see, you have options for themes, wallpapers, and icon packs. Um, so let's go ahead and tap on themes and I'll go ahead and show you all the pre-downloaded themes icon packs um, you already have downloaded if you do and if you don't just go ahead and slide over to free themes and this is where you can go ahead and easily download all the free themes they offer from the play store um, so this gives you an option for best new happy 2014 and my themes as well um, so right here on best, as you can see, there are a ton of these best themes right here. So you can just keep scrolling and you'll definitely be finding a theme that you really do enjoy and apply. New is so many more even, as you can see, just keep scrolling and scrolling. There are so many of these options. Um, so you have a wide variety of themes you can go ahead and apply. So current one I have applied is Toy Shop, but I can easily just go ahead and go to Sky Punch, tap on it, easily go ahead and install it, accept it, and all these are free themes, so you do not have to worry about paying, which is really, really nice. Tap on Open, tap on OK to apply the theme, and boom, it is completely changed up. As you can see, it is a whole different theme. Everything is all different. The font color is different, the wallpaper is different, even the icons are all different from the Google search to the clock widget, all the way down to the icons, and even applies to the app drawer as well. Um, so it really, does go, it really does go deep into the launcher, which is really, really nice. Um, as you can see, completely just changes the whole look. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and easily just show you how easily it is to change back to a previous theme you may have downloaded. Um, so here's my toy shop. I'm going to tap on it and boom, there it is. I'm back on my old theme really quickly and it, it went ahead and changed the font color, the wallpaper, and even the icon pack all throughout the launcher, which is really, really nice, I got to say. Um, as you can see, it looks fantastic and it's super nice to have. Um, also, on top of the, just the themes, you have other options too. So you have wallpapers, which come pre-installed if you want, or you can go to gallery or live wallpaper. So under Dodo Launcher, you have all these options too, so which are really nice. And some are the pre-downloaded ones. If you got it with an icon pack, it's there too, um, right there. And also you have icon packs if you have it pre-downloaded, or icon packs that come with the free themes, you can go ahead and launch that too. Um, so there it all is. Um, there too and also you have options to go ahead and change your fonts or ringtone and keyboard theme as well um, So if you go ahead and tap on more you have these options right up here So font ringtone and even keyboard so it's so just for this video We'll just go ahead and tap on font and change it up and we'll just choose choose launcher font right here And then we can go ahead and select any of these so currently right now It's I select on mono space we can go ahead and do a nice bold one So I'll do droid sans bold and now everything will be bold, will be bold Google's bold and even the icon, um, or I'm sorry, the app names are even bold and even goes all the way down to the app drawer right there too. Really, really nice as you can go ahead and even change fonts. And I know a lot of even bigger, um, you know, um, launchers don't even give you the option to go ahead and change, easily change all the themes all in one package and even change the fonts really this easily too. And you can also go ahead and change the keyboard and even ringtone all within this launcher, which is <laughs> really convenient, guys. Um, so let's go ahead and just show you, ended up with a little bit of preference. Um, and you can also do all the basic other things like add, add more screens, you know, transitions, you know, all the other great basic stuff that you see in a lot of other launches too. Main reason is customization, themes, and just, you know, just changing the whole look of your Android device using Dota Launcher. Um, so you have all these options for adding home screens, transitions, screen grid, all the other great stuff too, you know, wallpaper scrolling, all that great stuff, app drawer, you know, dock indicator, gestures, even fast launch. Uh, you can even back up and restore it, advanced settings. Um, so you guys get the idea that you have all the basic launcher settings that you usually get with any um, you know, third-party launcher. But on top of that, you also get customization options that you really don't see you know, for theming, wallpapers, icon packs, changing the ringtone, keyboard, fonts even. Um, and it applies really deep into the launcher as well. Um, so that's pretty much it guys for this video. This is Dota Launcher Review for your Android device. Link is down below where you can go ahead and download this free launcher from the Play Store in the video description. And if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe in the bottom left hand corner right there. And don't forget, to, don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+, which are also located down below. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.